roll it. Morning. Morning. <laughs> How to make four in 30 knots, Mommy. four meter away in the middle Mommy. of the Atlantic. Exactly. And Shane is vacuuming the boat. Okay. On, we gotta do this. Is that, is, this is not a crazy team. <laughs> I don't know what it is. You know, left Minello yesterday, and uh, we are right here cruising in 30 knots of wind. Come to the wild boy. <laughs> It's blowing 28 knots, 30 knots, all day long. We have the Genoa only. The good thing about this is uh, since we left, so we left about 21 hours ago, we made 141 miles, 6.6 .6 average. That's nice. Today, 6.8. So, yeah, it's wavy, it's windy. It's not super, super comfortable, but so far, so good. My hands are going numb. All right, grab the line. Grab the line right here. Yep. Come to Papa. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's go! There we go, Lena. Oh, he's doing something weird. <laughs> Hi, Lena. Are you staying busy? Bro, what's going on? First uh, shower, bro. Finally, huh? A little bit of rain? Yeah. Solar panels, they like that. Oh, yeah, give them a nice clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's had a couple inches of of salt starting to harden. Did you see that? So Africa, Cap Verde, it's here. How many miles ago? We made about 700 miles, something like this. This is our wood towards Martinique. We sure, are... it sure does uh, feel a little bit better watching that little dot of who we are. Get a little <laughs> bit closer towards the middle. 1,360 miles. Nautica miles left. So How many yeah. days we in? We're Check in the since... Ooh, we're making some solid time. Wow, 160 Nautica miles per day. So 96 hours is uh, is four days, so that, that's our fifth day today. Sweet. Let's do this. All right. It's looking decent. Can we try it? Yeah. What are we gonna do? So we're gonna put the long in sail and we're gonna reef it. You found out you could uh, not put it out fully, right? Yeah. That's so what reefing means for everybody that has no idea what that word means, because well, five minutes ago I had no idea. World of a difference, huh? Yeah, that's nice. We can finally see Finally, it. look at this. It took all day, but it's finally open. Oh, Waves calm down a little bit. We're finally not uh, washing up over the boat. The pump is starting to dry. Still have the tender, which is good. They're still not small, but they're not as big as they are. The only issue is when these waves come in rolling, they create some slack in here. The fabric on this sail is not as strong as the other one, so when it slacks and then when it pop, pops back open, it's, a, it's its highest chance to get ripped where the lines are holding it. So When it's perfect, it works, and when it's not enough wind, it's scary because we don't want to break it. Hello everyone! Everybody! Merry, Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! From the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Feliz Navidad! 
Yeah. We hope everybody has a great uh, holiday season with all the friends and family. We wish we could all be there together, but uh, we're all doing something crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we are almost halfway, so uh, it's not easy every day, but... Uh, we're doing it together. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sean and Lena, to have come on this trip. I love you guys. <laughs> yeah. You know, you're awesome. And uh, yeah, Merry Christmas. Merry yeah. Christmas, everybody. How's snack time, girl? Okay. Good. Yeah. Let's go. We got a couple, we got some miles out of that, huh? See some storm clouds coming in. Yeah. With these clouds come crazy random winds and uh, yeah. could be pouring rain and we just don't want to have to wrap that up in the rain and the wind. So try to let the storm pass and uh, maybe we'll have some daylight to get another half hour, hour out of it. Uh, I want to thank you. What a wild ride. Yeah, you know, you, you've been very essential for this uh, crossing. It's we been are. a really pleasure to do this with you. And, uh, and I, I can't thank you enough, but uh, don't worry. Together, bro, we, uh, we're getting it done. It's a wild, wild journey. It's, yeah. I think it's more than uh, we both kind of expected a little yeah, bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. The nights is crazy, the days are crazy, no breaks, but. Yeah, we're, we're, everyone's adapting, we're filling in, we're, we're having each help. Thank you guys, thank, thank you, you, thank Bowie. you so much for We would have never had this experience without you. No. You and Emma and the baby, it's yeah, incredible. It's, it's a wild ride, you know, I, I, I was expecting something, uh, you know why. But uh, <laughs> and the, last, the last two, three days are really, really wild, you know, 40, 40 knots off wind. Like three, four meter away, and it's gonna get stronger tomorrow after tomorrow, and then it should, it should be gone. You know? Ready for it, though. but it's been wide, it's very wide. You know? So, one more time, thank you so much. Well, uh, I love you. That's a crazy trip, man. Yeah, I'm blessed to do it with you guys. Thank you. It's an experience of a lifetime. You know? Connection with this, uh, this planet, and uh, I've been to some crazy places. Feeling that, get out of here. Yeah. Fighting for your life and enjoying it at the same time, you know, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a beautiful beast. It's actually there is moment of fear, moment of pleasure. It's it's so much uh, different uh, feelings. Yeah, it's a man, it's a, it's way more of a mental game than I had any idea. I you know experienced whoa crazy yeah across the Atlantic, but crazy how quick the, the brain can make you want to think yeah. negative or make you want to think positive and it's uh it's the power of the group you know you see somebody in a little stress yeah i think that's, a joke, say that's the key of a, of a good uh, crossing for yeah. Atlantic. of course the weather is part of it but if you have a good crew the energy can uh, yeah the energy is, is is very very important yeah, a lot of times I'm in my head, I'm like, yeah, this is crazy. And you look at me like, bro, just uh, let's keep going. And it changes everything, you know. You need that outside perspective sometimes that we don't get all the time. And, yeah, it's cool. I appreciate it. Thank you, all. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I want to say thank you to Emma <laughs> for throwing me those uh, crazy adventures. Sometimes it's wild, you know, here. And uh, when you have a kid and uh, your wife or girlfriend, whatever you call it, 
sometimes this this level is so hard, you know, it's so high. You know that uh, maybe you think it was a mistake, you know, and uh, I love you so much for this because um, you follow me everywhere. When it's shit, when it's good, and uh, yeah, I'm so happy to make you to make this adventure with you. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to arrive, you know, so we can release the stress. And uh, yeah, I love you. I love you. I love you too. And me, I want to say, I'm very thankful to have a captain and a boyfriend like this. I couldn't imagine doing it with anyone else and feeling so safe. I know with this guy is stressing so much for 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 us and but with you we are we are safe. The two girls uh, we are feeling very safe and we really love you. And you're the best boyfriend and the best dad. Thank you. <laughs> 1,000 miles. 1,000 miles. Night watch for the win. <laughs> Morning. Uh, do we sleep? <laughs> So we got some sleep. We got we got a good night, in yeah, fact, you know. Good. Sailing all night, you know, seven, eight knots. We hit a thousand miles. We hit a thousand miles, and then we wake up to another one. It's uh, <laughs> it's definitely one that makes you gut tight. I have 14 out of wind again, crazy wave, 15 feet easy. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be like this for at least two days. And uh, Wednesday it will uh, it will start to go down. What's a good mental uh, preparation is everything that's happened. We keep saying this is gonna be like this for a few days. And then we get through it, and then some new shit happens. So uh, it's crazier than it's been, but it's not yeah. gonna last forever. No, no, no. Hope so. Hope so. <laughs> what does this mean? All right. We put an alarm when it's over 14. Where are we? Adelina? On the hill? Huh? Where is Adelina? Adelina? Where is, where is she? Ah! Ah! Eh! Hey, on est là! Okay. On est quelque part par là! Let's go! So let's check something! This is the total trip since we left. Average speed 6.7, max speed that was yesterday 18 knots. Today, max speed 17.7. I don't count the days anymore, but uh, we are going good. We passed uh, halfway yesterday. Uh, since the last three days has been really rough, you know, a lot of wind, a lot of wave, uh, over 45 knots of uh, wind gusts sometimes. We had to raise the alarm on the boat because it was all the time ringing at 40 knots. So yeah, doing good, doing good. We have about 800 miles left from the to reach the Caribbean in Martinique. Uh, yeah, so far so good. You know, we just hope that uh, we can have uh, a little lighter winds, you know, lighter waves. Because so far we are sailing only with the Genoa, we would like to put the downwind sail to, to be 
be able to go really nice, you know, but with this wave it's uh, almost impossible. The sails go from one way to another one and the gusts are really, really too strong for this sail. So, yeah, so far so good. And, uh, yeah, keep going. <laughs> We've made 1,263 nautical miles since we left, averaging a speed of 6.7. This is pretty nice to me, with a max speed of 18 knots. And uh, today, average speed 7 knots, max speed 17.7. We have about a little more than 800 nautical miles left to reach Martinique. Let's check a little. 862. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Morning, another beautiful day on Pelis. It's still rainy, still windy, still wavy. Yeah, welcome to the Atlantic Crossing. So today and tomorrow should be like this. And uh, from Thursday should be better. Growing 30 knots, still uh, like three, four meter away, easy, but at least it's sunny today. So uh, normally it should be the last day. Tomorrow should be better. Have a good day, everyone. Thank you. same we take the same team and we do it again you know same wind same wave and now even more rain cloudy super cool have a good day everyone and this is how our mornings look like i don't know he's doing a puzzle everywhere is a little mess sean is doing watch and steve is in his bed that he's been sleeping in for one, like, I don't know, or since the beginning of all the
Finally, after one week sailing, even more. In fact, we managed to take out the downwind sail. So smooth. <laughs> it's nice. The game changer. <laughs> yeah. Especially when we thought it was going to be open the entire time we were out here. <laughs> yeah. yeah, because normally that's what it was supposed to be. To yeah, cross the Atlantic with the downwind sail, you know, all the way long. But we got 30 knots all the way, you know. And, well, anyway, no need to complain. Everything is good. We, we are sailing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's good. Wow. 11 knots. Amazing. Now the port on the back. <laughs> the waves. Oh yeah, trains, you know. Hey, good morning! Oh, la, 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 la. Finally, finally. The wave is still here. Wind, we have about 20 knots of wind, but which is much more comfortable than the 30, 40 plus knot we had since the last week. Let me show you the wave. It's not that bad, it's not that bad, you know. A little less than 3 meters. We're still flying downwind. Everything is cool. What are you doing? Okay. I don't know. Yeah. Watch. yeah. So, where are we? Are? We left from Cap Verde on 19 December, still in the Atlantic. We have about. Uh, 400 miles yeah. left today is something when the wind is becoming too strong and the sail is entirely out you can reef the sail it means you can reduce the quantity of sail you have outside so we do this by rolling it with the funnel right here. Then you roll the sail around the, the pole and reduce the size so we can go with a bit more wind and it's gonna be much less force on the sail, you know. T'es content d'arriver? You cross, almost cross the Atlantic Ocean. Congratulations, you crazy guys. 10k. 10,000 miles on Telus since we have the boat. We traveled about uh, two months in 2021. Because of COVID and stuff, we had to leave the boat somewhere. And then the rest was made in 2022. So uh, this is in less than one year, in fact. You know, I'm going to count exactly, but I will say like about 10 months, maybe. So yeah, 10,000 nautical miles on sailing Telus. Congratulations. <laughs> we are about 200 nautical miles from uh, Martinique. Uh, still sailing downwind. Today is great. You know, the wave much lower, much lower. I would say like 2.5 meters. But feels very comfortable. Steady wind on, uh, on our back. We can smell the Martinique, you know, coming. The beach, the coconut trees, the rum the calm you know we can't wait for this today today 7.1 average speed that's nice we already made 88 miles let's see where we are we are here yeah a little more than 200 miles left
did it. Can't believe we made it. We left uh, Las Palmas, Gran Canaria. Seven days, we traveled to uh, Cape Verde. Stopped, gassed up, 48 hours, we left. 13 days later, we just made it to Martinique. We're about to uh, try to find a little beach to hide out before we can check into immigration tomorrow. Super proud of everybody. It's been a, a wild journey. So much more than we ever expected. Weather was crazy. Everybody made it through though. Champs, best group I could have ever wanted to do it with. And uh, can't wait to see what we want to try next. Let's go. <laughs> Of course, the Atlantic Ocean with these crazy people <laughs> and uh, these crazy girls. It happened. Thank you, Walt. Thank you for honestly the trip of my life. God, the same thing. Is, me, uh, you know. That was wild. Life is crazy to just sit down on the beach. Yeah. Main question everybody's wondering right now. I've been asked a hundred times. Would you do it again? Of course I would. You know. <laughs> I said it last <laughs> night, dude. I said it last night. Uh, before we got here, before the anchor dropped down, I said never again. <laughs> but like the the appreciation afterwards and like what we really just did, it was it was worth it. It was all worth it. If it's the same crew, yes. It told yeah. a lot about everybody, you know. Adelina, are you happy at the beach? Happy, happy at the beach. Are you happy? Happy. Woohoo! Thursday in Martinique. Hey, gotta do it good. We're going back to the boat because we cannot find any tequila or champagne uh, by the glass anywhere on this part of the island. Um, they look at us like we're a little crazy when we ask. We are so happy to have touched land. Nobody's been land sick, thankfully. Uh, Emma and I walked up and down the beach just exploring a little bit. And it's a good day, it's a good day. <laughs> the second of January, second day of the year. Wonderful. <laughs> Back to the beach. Yay! Happy New Year! <laughs> Happy New Year! <laughs> Happy New Year! <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year! 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 Happ